Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, Christmas is rapidly approaching us, so I thought that I would jump on and do a little gifting guide video because I always get so stuck um, around Christmas. Um, me and my family, we do um, Kris Kringle within my siblings and then I do Kris Kringle with all of my cousins and stuff, but I always find it really hard to think of um, some things to get. So I thought that I would kind of compile a list of things that I have found really effective or I have seen other people buy for at work or things like that um, just so you guys can kind of have a little bit of an idea if you are struggling for Christmas gifts it is one week until Christmas so um, I personally haven't started my Christmas shopping so if you haven't I hope this is a little bit helpful for you and if not then I am sorry <laughs> um, also if you do want to see this makeup look keep an eye on my channel make sure you hit subscribe and turn the notification bell on because this video will be up just before Christmas it's my little um, Christmas glam makeup look so keep an eye on my channel if you want to see this makeup look there will be a couple more Christmas videos um, coming but yeah anyway I'm gonna jump straight on into it so okay so I'm kind of gonna start from the cheapest to the more expensive I haven't got anything super expensive on there for a sister just because I don't know how much you want to spend on your sister but it just depends um, so the first thing that I thought would be a great gift was the Tarte uh, eyelash curler they bring out one every single year and I always buy one for myself I've always bought one as a Kris Kringle present if I've had a girl for Kris Kringle um, I think it's literally the cutest gift ever I'll show you the ones that I've collected over the years so this was the first year that I was at Sephora it's just like a little purple bedazzled one then the second year I was at Sephora I got this one which is more of a crystal like bedazzled goldy one then last year for Christmas they bought out the pineapple one which is probably my favourite because I love pineapple and then they also did bring out a limited edition mermaid one as well mid-year but I love them I think they're such a cute little gift who doesn't want an eyelash curler they're a little bit sparkly everyone loves a bit of sparkle even if you deny it you love a bit of sparkle um, but I just think you can't go wrong with an eyelash curler. It's $34 and it does come with a mini mascara as well. This year it's the, uh, the new Tarte Big Ego Mascara, which is a really nice volumizing mascara. Again, I can't go wrong with a mascara and a lash curler, I don't think. So that one is $34. You can buy it at Sephora. A lot of the stuff is from Sephora, not sponsored. Um, but yeah, they just have some great gifts in there at the moment. So yeah, $34 from Sephora. Why not? The second thing that I thought of for a sister, but this could also go for like a cousin or a Kris Kringle if the budget's a little bit higher for anyone who's like a little bit younger. This is the, it's from a brand called The Card Network and it's just called the Fashion Gift Card for her. Now, this card gives you access to Nike, Mac, Bardo, which has gone into liquidation, um, Platypus, Forever New, Tiger Mist, Shopo, Sea Folly and Sunburn Swimwear, Tony Bianco, Avida, Princess Polly, Adidas, and H&M. I don't know about you, but I would love, love, love a gift card like that. I think that's such a perfect gift. It literally gives you access without it being like a really shitty generic gift card. It gives you um, access, I guess, to some really awesome like places, especially the fact that Princess Polly is on there. I think that's awesome. Um, and Tiger Mist, in fact. Um, you can set the denominations for this. I think it goes up in 50, so 50, 100, 150, 200, depending on how much you wanted to spend, which is why I thought this was a good one to throw in there for everyone, because if you do really want to really splurge, you can get like a $200 one, or if it's just a Kris Kringle or your cousin that you're not really close with, you can just get like a $50 one, if that's your kind of budget. Um, but yeah, I love that. I think it's such a great gift idea. I'll see if I can find a screenshot and pop it here but I bought my brother one of the boys ones for Christmas I mean for his birthday which I'll talk about a little bit later and he loves it so yeah the next thing I thought of and this could kind of go for anyone but I just popped it in this category because I think it's awesome it is just a tile so it's $30 from a JB Hi-Fi or you can just order it online from their website I think um, but basically you put it on your keys and then you download an app on your phone and it just means you can find your keys a lot easier I oops sorry I personally lose my keys all the time and I know that my mum does too and a lot of other people I know and Peyton has a tile and it's the best thing ever so you just pop it on your keys 
ring the little thing on your app and it makes a noise so that you can find your keys a lot easier. That one's only $30, so again, a good stocking filler, or if your budget's not that big, a good little thing to get. I think it's useful, it's practical. Um, the next thing, if your budget is a little bit higher, although this still isn't super expensive, is just a personalized necklace. I think this is such a nice, like, like I got mine for, I got it before I went to America. I think it's just such a nice personalized gift and I feel like everybody loves them. Um, I think they're such a good gift idea. So I've got two options here. One is from Neck on the Line, except I don't think this would get here in time for Christmas, but just for future reference. Um, so it has like that old English Gothic style writing, which is really cute. It is 32 Great British Pounds and plus shipping, it probably comes to around $60 Australian. Um, but yeah, I think they're really, really cute. And I love that font as well. Um, and then the other thing, the other personalized necklace is where I got mine from, so it's the Oak and Luna um, Mon Petit name necklace. Again, you can choose the font, you can choose the metal. Um, I personally love like the cursive script on mine, um, but that one is eighty dollars, and they do have a promotion at the moment, which is um, ten percent off shipping to Australia, and there is a Christmas shipping guarantee. I'm pretty sure so. That is a really, really cute present. Again, it's super customizable. Um, I think that anything that's customizable or personalized always goes such a long way because it means that you really put effort into that present. Um, yeah, super cute. The next one is kind of in a couple of categories. It's just a house plant. I feel like plants are such a trendy thing right now. As you can see, I've got, that one's not real. This one is, and I have another one up there. I've got another two. If you watch my vlogs, you would have seen my plants before, but I would be stoked with a plant, and they can range from anywhere to like, from like $25 to $150. So kind of gives you a wide range as well, depending on the plant you want to get. For my brother's birthday, I got him um, two plants, no, three plants, and he absolutely loves them. Um, my auntie literally just asked for a plant, so I feel like you can't go wrong with whoever you buy them for. Just make sure you get a pot as well, um, so you don't have like an ugly black pot, um, so that they can actually display their plant nicely. Um, yeah, I think that is such a good present. I love plants. Um, they kind of give you a life purpose, something to look after. They don't have a pet, they give you a little friend. Um, but yeah, I love plants. You can get them from Flower Power, Bunnings. Um, there is a shop at Warringah Mall as well, and I think it's kind of like a franchise. It's called Grow, and they specialize in indoor plants. Um, make sure it is an indoor plant. I don't think anyone really wants an outdoor plant, like unless they have like a garden. But yeah, indoor plants. Um, but yeah, Flower Power, Bunnings, Grow, and as I said, they range between about $25 to $150. So I also thought of just the Zoeva Rose Golden Brush Set. This is just from Sephora, or you can order it online, but I know this one specifically you can get in stores. It's $139 if you did want to spend that a little bit more, um, but I think it's so cute. I love the Rose Golden. Um, can't go wrong with that. They do have a couple of other like colors of sets as well, but I think this one's a really good essentials brush set because you've got um, your foundation brush, you've got a contour brush, you've got a blush and bronzer brush, you've got a fluffy crease brush, a flat shader brush, wing liner brush, and a smudger brush as well. Did I miss any? Oh, and a brow brush. Um, I think it's perfect for people who are just starting makeup or even just as like the basics makeup brush set to have. I think it's awesome. And the last thing I, that I had in the sister category was a slip pillowcase. They're just the silk pillowcases. I have two. They come in a range of different colours. Specifically, I thought the pink marble one was really cute. Um, but yeah, it's kind of up to you what you think they would like. They have black, they have navy, charcoal, caramel, light pink, white, normal marble, one with kisses on it, one with like little eyes on it um, yeah I think they're so sweet you can get them in different sizes as well um, but I think that is really really awesome um, silk pillowcases help with anti-aging hair breakage hair like health overall um, yeah they make sure you don't get all those like lines and crinkles on your face when you wake up from sleeping on a crinkly pillow they're awesome I love mine and such a good gift they feel super super luxurious as well they are $95 so again a little bit higher in price and if you wanted to get to it would be higher up there but I think it's an awesome gift people come in for them for gifts all the time um, 
yeah that is it for the sister category and then for the niece or cousin category um this is kind of like again for younger cousins or like younger nieces but um I was thinking the Blockbuster palette from Sephora collection. This one's awesome. It's the Igloo palette. You've got a whole bunch of eyeshadows, you've got brow colors, you've got eyeliners, you've got lipsticks, blushes, bronzers, highlighters, everything anyone could ever need when they're first starting out. I would kind of suggest this for someone who's maybe 11 to 16. Anyone over that probably wouldn't want something like that. Um, but I think it's a great starter kit for anyone who loves makeup, as a lot of people do these days. It's $66, so it is a little bit more more pricey um, if you didn't want to spend that much on your cousin but again with the Sephora collection um, products at the moment if you buy three you get the fourth free so you could grab a couple of things they have um, you know shower kits and like cooling eye patches eyeshadow palettes like heaps of really good stuff so you could go in there and get a couple of gifts and then get the cheapest one for free so that is a really good um, gift for someone who is a little bit younger um, they, in Sephora collection as well, they do have this little charcoal kit which comes with um, a face mask, two face masks, a nose mask, I think. Yeah, so it comes with a charcoal face mask, a charcoal nose mask, and two body scrubs, which is awesome. Charcoal is really good for detoxifying the skin, so if they are more of an adolescent, they may have um, blemish prone skin. I wouldn't buy it for anyone under 12, it's probably a little bit too harsh, but anyone from like 12 to even 20 years old I think would love that. Everyone loves a good face mask and really good for most skin types, unless they're dry or sensitive, I wouldn't recommend it. But as like a generic thing, it would be a pretty good gift and it's $27, so definitely good for a Kris Kringle or someone that you didn't want to spend too much on or couldn't spend too much on, a really great gift. I did have um, brushes in there as well. Again, probably just the Sephora collection ones, if you unless you wanted to spend a lot. Um, they do have this super cute double-ended brush set at the moment. It's $42, and you get three brushes that are double-ended. So one's got like a blush and bronzer, one's got two eyeshadow brushes, and one's got a brow brush with a spoolie on the other end. $42, you get six brushes basically. Um, I think that's awesome again goes in with the buy three Sephora products get the fourth free um, yeah I think that's a really good gift again for someone who's just starting out into makeup or who doesn't have much makeup or wouldn't have a lot of brushes otherwise you can start delving into the Zoeva brushes if you wanted something a little bit more of a higher price point but it's just a really good overall gift for yeah if you had them for Kris Kringle or something like that I also put a keep cup into this category um, that goes for like literally anyone of any age, um, even there, if they're an older cousin, a keep cup is such a good gift, um, whether they drink hot chocolate, tea, coffee, I don't know, you can even drink water out of a keep cup if you so desire, but sustainability, trying to promote that, especially in the younger ages, if they are younger, maybe like 15 upwards. Um, yeah, sustainability means they don't have to buy a coffee cup every day. Um, they can just take their keep cup with them. This falls into a lot of categories. Um, I would even put this into a Kris Kringle category or the boys category. Um, anyone can buy a keep cup. My favourite are these ones from Mr. and Mrs. Jones. Um, I think they're so cute. Let me just get the price. Perfect. So this keep cup is $27 for the bigger keep cup. I personally bought the little one and it wasn't big enough for me so I had to get a big one as well. It comes in heaps of cute different colours. You can get it online from Mr and Mrs Jones or I think they have stores in Chatswood and Bringham Mall and maybe Macquarie. I can't remember but yeah such a good gift. Everyone loves a keep cup. Not super super expensive. Um, perfect for a Kris Kringle budget or again somebody not that close to. For the little, little ones, I thought we could get, um, I know this is what I've got for my little cousin Maggie for Christmas, um, just a few of the Bonds um, zip-up rompers, depending on what size they are, obviously, but I was thinking like really, really little. Um, if you buy four baby things from Bonds, you get 40% off anyway, so you could get like a couple of the little Bonds rompers, or even like they have really cute little swimsuits as well, which is so cute. Um, so the little zippy romper wonder suits are currently on sale for $15, which is hectic. Um, I mean, the buy four, get 40% off wouldn't probably apply to that, but $15, I'm going to go in and buy more for Maggie and Rose, because I need to get Rose some as well. Um, and the swimsuit is $30, so I think that's so cute. I got this little lobster one for Maggie. So cute for the little ones. And then the other thing I was thinking of was from David Jones. They have a bunch of different, like, Christmas... Um, 
baby rompers. They're $40. They've got like a pudding. Um, I think they have like a reindeer. I'll pop them here. But oh my gosh, they're so cute. $40 and yeah. Only thing is I'll only be able to wear them for one Christmas. But whatever. Bit of fun. The last thing that I had was for like an older cousin or maybe like 20 upwards was just a plant as well. For all the same benefits as I said before. Can't go wrong. For some Kris Kringle gifts. <laughs> I just spat. For some Kris Kringle gifts for girls as well, um, the first thing I had was this little Turby Twist from um, Woolworths. It's basically just a microfiber towel that you put on after you wash your hair, pop it in the towel, and it just absorbs the water really, really quickly. Helps your hair dry faster. I love mine. I literally use mine every time I wash my hair, unless I let it dry, naturally. Um, but if I'm going to blow dry it, I'll pop it straight in there. Um, and it's $12. You can literally get it from Woolworths or order a water online. I'm sure there's probably more expensive ones if you wanted to splurge a little bit more. But it's just a microfiber towel. You chuck your hair in it, twist it, put it up. It's got a little button at the back. The best thing ever. Can't go wrong unless they have no hair. Then obviously irrelevant. But yeah. On here as well, I just had a keep cup. Again, good for everyone. Same benefits as before. It's a keep cup. You know? I also wrote down this little fresh set. This one is um, $33 and you get two of the sugar lip balms and one of the like lip balm lip balm, if that makes sense. Um, such a good gift. Can't go wrong with lip balm. These lip balms are literally the best thing ever. They've got sugar in them. Sugar is a natural humectant. It draws moisture into the lips or into the skin if it's used on the skin. They're amazing. They come in like a coloured one and a clear one and then just the hydrating balm as well. So amazing. $33. You know. The last thing that I had was just from some uh, hair clips from Colette or Seed. They range from like $15 to $30. I love hair clips. I think hair clips are super on trend right now. So if they do kind of follow trends or um, they have hair. <laughs> um, can't go wrong with hair clips. Again, they can be like a little add-on or a stocking stuffer or if you just didn't want to spend that much, $15 hair clips. Too easy. That is kind of all I had for Kris Kringle. All the things I mentioned before, you can kind of chuck into Kris Kringle as well, depending on the budget or the, the limit or whatever you have. Um, but yeah, now jumping on to the mum. Now I think everyone loves to spoil their mum as I've gotten older and started earning more of my own money. I love buying as much as I can for my mum. So I had a couple of different things in here. Um, so I had the Fresh Mask Set. This is amazing. I think it's $121 for memory. Um, or 123, 123 I think, and it comes with the Rose Hydrating Face Mask, the Black Tea Overnight Firming Mask, really really amazing for anti-aging, the Black Tea Instant Perfecting Mask, again awesome for anti-aging, um, literally good for all skin types, and the Vitamin Nectar Vibrance Boosting um, Mask as well, so that one's going to help to brighten, um, add a bit of glow back in the skin, it's a really really luxurious set as well, and you get a decent amount of product in each of the masks, even though they are minis. Um, I think that's really, really nice. Even if your mum's not that into skincare, everyone loves a bit of a mask, everyone loves a bit of pamper time, and it is super, super luxurious with all the scents and everything. So I think that that would be an awesome, awesome gift. I kind of have gone out of like money order, but whatever. The other thing I was thinking was, I know this this is kind of based off what my mum loves, but she loves lipsticks. Um, so I always try and get her like a Givenchy lipstick or a YSL lipstick, something that's a little bit more high end. I think Givenchy lipsticks are 59. Um, pretty sure YSL lipsticks are the same, same as Dior, 59 to kind of $70 maybe. Um, but you can't go wrong with just like a nudie pinky shade or even a red if she's a little bit more bold, but a luxurious luxurious lipstick goes um, a long way. She'll use it forever. I am loving the Pandora charm bracelets at the moment so um, I was thinking just the Pandora mesh bracelet in the rose gold. You can get it in different colors as well. I just think I just love rose gold and so does my mum. So the bracelet is $199 by itself so maybe you could buy the bracelet and you could get your siblings to buy some charms or if you wanted to spend more you could get the charms as well but or all of your siblings could put in for it together if you have siblings. Um, but yeah the Pandora charm bracelet and then they do have heaps of Christmas charms as well. They've got like reindeers and um, a little mum love heart charm which is super super cute. I bought that for my mum. Um, they also have yeah some really other beautiful like glass ones and 
stuff like that. So such a good gift and then it's something that you can add on to every year so that she has all these Christmas memories um, which I think is super super sweet again more of a higher price point but who doesn't want to spoil their mum now this next one obviously is super expensive so definitely higher in the budget but it is a Dyson hairdryer or a Dyson air wrap but I think mums because they're probably in a rush all the time or on the go they probably have more appreciation for just the hairdryer rather than the air wrap where they have to like sit down and fully style their hair unless your mum's really into that but that one is $800 whereas the hair dryer is $549 um, I think that is such a great gift it's going to improve the overall health of their hair um, it's going to actually it's actually a lot lighter than your traditional hair dryer because the motor is actually in the handle not sitting above the hand like your traditional hair dryer so it's a lot more ergonomic for them um, if they have shoulder pain my mum has shoulder pain so I know that that's a lot easier for her Definitely higher up in the budget, but I think it would be a great present. Again, you can put in for it with your siblings or with your dad or whatever, um, or you can just splurge. Um, and the last thing that I had here, obviously, this can go for anyone, but was a calming blanket. You guys know I recently got my calming blanket and I absolutely love it. I do have a discount code, it's Genevieve115. It saves you $150 on a calming blanket, which is normally around $300. You can get the doubles, so you can get one for your mom and dad, or you can get the singles for your sister or anything like that. Super cute, come in heaps of different colors and a really, really good gift for anyone, even if they're just sleep deprived or anxious or anything like that. An awesome gift for anyone. Again, I have a discount code, Genevieve115. Um, this is not sponsored again, but I just think it's a good gift anyway. Alrighty, jumping on to the boys' gifts. Um, again, I didn't really put these into categories. I just kind of wrote down a couple of different ideas and we'll just go through them. Um, I find that boys always love like anything technology-based. So like, um, yeah, the first thing that I had was this little speaker. It's by um, some designing brand, but you can just get it from Amazon or from hardtofind.com. I'll pop it on the screen. It's roughly 50, no, I think it's $69. Um, it's just a little Bluetooth speaker. The sound quality is amazing. You can connect it to your phone. Super, really good, super, really good. Super good for travel. Um, yeah, it's a really, really awesome speaker, and I feel like guys love things like that. They can take it to the beach, or take it to sporting games, take it out drinking, like if they're having like pre's or playing beer pong or something. I don't know. I'm being so stereotypical, but whatever. <coughs> I think they're an awesome, awesome gift, and I feel like you could give this for anyone. This could be a brother, this could be a cousin, this could be a Kris Kringle, this could be your dad. I know my stepdad has one, um, or even just a boyfriend, which I didn't even think of, but maybe you'd probably get something a little bit more personal for your boyfriend I don't know I don't have one so can't relate um, the next thing that I had on here was um, again that same fashion card but for him so yeah the gift card for him from the card network again you can set it in your own denomination 50 100 150 blah 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 blah, blah. Um, it gives you money to spend at Nike Calibre, I don't know what that is, Culture Kings, Diesel, Neverland, Aquila, Platypus, Academy Brand, Foot Locker, Timberland, Surf Stitch, and Adidas. Don't know about you, but that's fucking awesome. Even I would love that. Like, that would be such a good gift. I bought one for my brother for his birthday, and he's literally asked for another one for Christmas. So, obviously, that's such an awesome gift, especially when it gives you um, money to spend at places like Culture Kings or Platypus, which is super random, but you can get sneakers, hats, belts whatever the heck they want, the world is there, always start with this gift card. So you can set it in a denomination for your brother if you want to spend a little bit more, etc, etc, etc. The next one is kind of typical, you can get this for like your dad or your boyfriend. Um, it's just a cologne, obviously, it's kind of always on the list, but I think it, it's still really a nice gift. Scents can be really personal, but um, I find that if you give them a scent, then every time they smell it, it kind of is going to remind you of them. Um, some of my personal favourites are Paco Rabanne Pure Excess, um, Dior Sport for him, um, Dior Sauvage, I personally don't like Sauvage, but it's super popular for men, um, Tom Ford Ombre Leather if you wanted to go a little bit more expensive and bougie, um, but yeah, can't go wrong with cologne, I don't think, if, unless I don't like the smell. Maybe ask for a sample first, and then, I don't know. Um, 
But yeah, again, it's a super personal gift. Whenever they smell that thing, they're gonna think of you. So I think that's really cute for your boyfriend or for your dad. Um, yeah. Um, headphones. Headphones are also really good if you know that they go to the gym or if they catch public transport or they just like listening to music. Um, headphones can range literally between 50 to like $500. Um, me and my siblings bought my dad a pair of Beats for Christmas, wireless Beat headphones. Please don't watch this video, Dad. Um, but yeah, I know that he wanted them for the gym, but even if they just get public transport to work or they walk to work or they want to listen to music or something at home, I don't know. Again, range between literally $50 for some ones from JB Hi-Fi to $300, $500. Again, I think the ones that I had got were $40 off, so they are probably a couple of Christmas specials around at the moment if you wanted to check them out. Um, if you know that they're into exercise or they like gym, like going to the gym, you could just get them a gym towel or a gym bag or a water bottle. Um, this can go for the girls as well, obviously. I actually just asked for a gym towel for Christmas, so a pink one. Um, so yeah, could go for anyone who's into exercise or um, sport or anything like that. Um, gym towel, gym bag, you can just get a couple from JB Hi-Fi. These are kind of generic ones so I'm not really talking about prices and stuff but I can pop a couple of options on the screen for you guys if you'd like. Um, I keep using like myself as an example but literally for my dad's birthday we got him a gym bag and a water bottle. Um, so, I don't know. I don't know. Um, another thing that I thought of was a portable charger. Um, I know there's really good ones from, I think the brand is Signet or something, it's like $75, um, lasts for like 10 charges or something, really really awesome. If they go to festivals, or they go camping a lot, or they just run out of battery on their phone a lot, if they catch the train to work and use their phone while they work, um, and they can't charge it at work for some reason, you know, can't go wrong. Boys love techie things, that's what I find. Um, I thought this was kind of like a cute gimmicky thing, but it could be like cute for a Kris Kringle or a cousin or something. It's just one of those like ring bottle openers. Um, I'll pop an option on the screen, I haven't researched it, don't know how much they are, but... Or even just a bottle opener in general. I know that um, Universal Store has a really cute Stormtrooper bottle opener, which I would even like. <laughs> um, the last thing that I had on here that aren't already mentioned was um, like a beard oil set, if they have a beard. These beard oil and beard balm sets are really, really actually good because they help to nourish the hair and the beard. They nourish the skin underneath. I got um, a nice one from Tommy Guns, um, which you can get online or they have a store at Warringah Mall. Um, they have beard oil, beard balm, they come in heaps of different scents. Um, again, really good for the skin and the hair. Um, so really good if your spouse, brother, dad is like a beard lover, really takes care of their beard like I know my brother does, um, beard oil would be an awesome thing to grab. They come in little packs as well so you can get some value for money. Um, and just the last things I had on here I've already spoken about, so a tile, a plant or a keep cup. I bought my other brother, as I said, a couple of plants for his birthday and he loved them. So that is all the ideas I had. Again, I'll make sure that I pop everything on the screen even though you probably would have already seen that because this is the end of the video, but they're all the ideas that I had. If you have any ideas, make sure you pop them below because I am still stuck even though I've just brainstormed all these ideas. Um, if you can think of anything that you would add or what you bought for Christmas or what you would like for Christmas, pop it in the comments below. Um, make sure you turn the notifications bell on and subscribe to my channel for more Christmas videos, especially this makeup look that will be coming very soon. And I'm also going to do a little um, Christmas dessert cooking video as well. So thank you guys so much for watching. I will catch you on my next video and have a good Christmas.